I appreciate it. All right. Copycat. Copycat. If you have a great Lou Glue Nala, yeah, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, I got one of those laying around. Sure, 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 sure. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do another copycat set. Because, you know, we've got to try a bunch of new Pokemon uh, while doing this, so I can't complain. Fermets. Good luck, friend. What do we got? We got Ampharos into Claude Sire. Well, the good news is our back line is technically okay into Claude Sire, right? Ooh. Oh, no. Y'all. I don't have anything to hit this Diggersby with. Everything's double resisted. <laughs> no. No. <sighs> and now we're debuffed. And now we're debuffed too. <laughs> I've got non stab double resisted moves. Oh my god, we got a shield. Oh my god, it happened. We got a shield. <laughs> Also, I don't know how we beat this thing in general, but we we got a shield. What do we do? Uh, like, Guru is our best Pokemon into it, but we don't really... I'm going to have to do it, but like we're going to have to just protect the Oranguru, I guess. Because we're just not doing any damage to this thing with Ampharos, right? Like, just literally doing nothing with Ampharos. Oh, come on. All right. Well, I think what we're doing is we're just giving them back these shields and protecting our, uh, our monkey here. And probably sacrificing Ampharos, right? Oh, that's bad. What's their other Pokemon? Dugong. Okay, well, let's hit it with Trailblaze real quick. Yeah, I know. This is bad. <laughs> this feels pretty bad. I really don't think we have much of a chance of winning this game. Like, I, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I think our team does not line up well into their team at all. Um... If we had, you know what? If we had safe swapped the Oranguru, I actually think we have a chance here. Because um, they wouldn't have had a good Pokemon to put into Oranguru, basically. Whereas they did have a good Pokemon to put into uh, to Hypno, obviously. It would have actually been okay. Because then we do have like a pretty reasonable chance of winning Switch Advantage, and then a pretty reasonable chance of finding a way to win the game from there. But how? All right. Well, they're also on the community day mega horn. So we're not, we're not winning. Oh, that's bad. That was bad. Y'all. I think we're going to have to just, uh, chalk that one up to some bad, some bad mojo, but yeah, we should have safe swapped or but hindsight's 2020. Hindsight is 2020 in that regard. So, Diggersby. Yeah. Okay, sure. Sure, why not? Let's try our luck. Let's try our luck with this team. Uh, Swampert. Mm, that's pretty bad. That's actually genuinely awful for us, isn't it? <laughs> Even a 1469 Swampert is probably too much Swampert for us to handle. Oh my god, my opponent just switched. 
My opponent... Oh, but they switched into something that we're also bad against. And they caught it. Oh, and they shielded. Okay. Okay. What the shit do we do? Yeah, I know Dugong, but the problem here is that, like, we have to also remember that Swampert remains an issue for us, right? So, I'm a little worried now that we've put more or less our best Swampert counter into a spot where it has to, you know, do something. Okay. If we can catch a shadow ball, that would be really good, right? Actually, I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna bother trying to catch a shadow ball. We're gonna just do well, okay. They can do whatever they want. But I can also hyper beam their swampert. One, because shadow ball ain't gonna do shit. And I think we might be able to survive a uh I think we survive a hydro cannon if i don't then this was a terrible wager and i should have just gone for come on do it we do okay pew upside of playing uh at the beginning of the season is that not all of your opponents are terribly experienced and that may have been an issue where they simply forgot that diggersby was a normal type it's very possible they did not assume they forgot or did not know so i think that i think my opponent probably has a lot of a lot of of work to still do when it comes to just generating that knowledge and that's okay we're all at different points of our journey so They've got, they've got, they've got some, some knowledge probably that they need to, uh, continue to build, work on building. Swampert. Skeledurge. And, uh, what was the other, uh, random Pokemon? Ah. It, it, it can't be single moved. Given that it's only 10k for the second move, it'd be wild to me if it was single moved. But I think it's equally likely that they just didn't know what to throw there. So even if it was single move, they shouldn't have thrown Shadow Ball anyway. They should have just not thrown that move. They should have switched. Right? Got to that move, switched. Tried to set up a scenario where that Shadow Ball, they could throw it into the Dugong. Um, and uh, Septile. Which I do actually have. Let's do it. Let's do it. But... Either way, it's it's good it's good practice to be kind uh, when it comes to your opponents and mistakes that they've made and the things that they still maybe need to learn. Medical ham. I don't love this because uh, it's not a great matchup for us, but maybe we can find a scenario where we like either catch something or. Gonna be an ice punch. Ice punch, I wouldn't. Okay. That's okay. Well, the worst they could do to me is psychic, which is recently worsened so nope pup 
So we're pretty happy to take a pup. <laughs> I'm not going to give you my shield there. Absolutely not. All right. They're shielding this. This is also fine because we don't have a option here. I, I literally cannot afford for this to uh, get loose. So we're going to have to commit to shielding some poison fangs here, which feels pretty bad, but I won't beat this thing otherwise. So hopefully this just kills them and then we don't have to worry about it. Perfect. That's what you like to see. Uh, you can do whatever you want here. I'm not shielding Ice Punch or Pup. Ice Punch. Sure. We're just going to farm you. And then let's hope... Money. I was really worried that they would get enough fast move damage to do kill me in the five turns, but... Nah. Nah. <laughs> GG's. Dirge sweep. Turns out Skeledurge is pretty good, y'all. With the uh, bonus incinerate damage. Feels pretty nice. Feels pretty uh feels pretty potent. Uh Metacham Golbat and Galvantula. Cool. Neat squad. Let's go. Yeah. Seems like fun. Seems like fun. All right, B King, good luck. Uh, ooh, that's a that's a tough that's a tough break out of the lead for us. I think they go straight Shadow Ball. Nope, that's a Seed Bomb. I don't know that I like seed bombing here if you, uh, given that they're pretty similar moves, but. And then we CMP again. All right. Seed bomb me. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Metacham dies, but hopefully we can use all this newfangled power. To find a way to win here. This is kind of an awkward Pokemon for us. Night Slash, Earthquake. Yeah, I don't think this is where we want to be shielding. I know a little bit of an unorthodox switch here, but I have a plan. It just might not be a good one. It might not be a good one. I Oh, nope. That's not, that's not anywhere near as... Uh, oh, it's almost right. I know it's resisted, but I was hoping it would do a little more damage than that. But we're going to come out of this with some energy, and then if it's Trevenant coming back, I can lunge it. And then hope that these two Pokemon with a little bit of running start can overcome the fact that they're a little bit low on health. Uh, that's not the Pokemon I wanted to see. Because we're in a spot now where, like... Oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh, I overtapped. Oh, please? Yes, let's go. The lunge, the lunge did it. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. 
Who was worried? Who was worried? Yeah, thank God Ice Punch is a bad move and that we de debuffed our opponent and that we managed to, uh, I don't know, just, just. Sometimes uh, a plan comes together. <laughs> Sometimes a plan comes together and uh, you, you make it work. That's one of those times. I'm, I'm shocked. Genuinely shocked that that worked out for us. All right. All right, Ronnie. Good luck, friend. Uh, that's pretty bad. That's pretty not great, obviously, but I think we just one shot it with a shadow ball and call it a day. Could we maybe just consider not having uh, mono flyers on the other side? <laughs> that would be great. My team doesn't really want to see any flyers, let alone uh, Crobat into this. What the shit? What are we supposed to do? My team hates this. Like, genuinely hates it. Uh, boy. They really do need to be baiting me, but... Yeah, that's a good that's a good bait. Good bait opponent. And then Hasuian Voltorb. awkward so I do kind of like I think my win conditions are all going to be farm related but I don't know that I'm going to be able to farm this thing oh well I'm going to farm it with Metacham I guess is also fine if it works but it also has to work okay so that did work so that's good Please, please, God, let the psychic, let the psychic debuff not be bad enough that we lose this game. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're still going to kill it with psychic. Pretty sure psychic does the amount of damage necessary. <laughs> GG's. Lord. In the last couple of games in that set definitely fell into sweaty palms territory I tell you what <laughs> oh good a Gligar reward for our trouble that feels that feels somehow fitting that feels somehow fitting gross gross 